Oh, we've been chatting. Nicholas Folk joins me after the movie's premiere last night. You were just saying we could get a wee sofa in for you because you, you would quite like I'm that. I'm a fan of the show, so it would like be lovely watching. if I could just... I, I like watching, so yeah. I'd like to have my own little area just to okay. be cosy and watch We can do that. If that's OK. Uh, it's absolutely fine. You can sit there with my little Angus, my dog, and, and just watch things unfold. Perfect, thank Sounds you. Sounds good to me. <laughs> thank how you, I'm the, moving in. How was the premiere? How was it? Was it, good? Uh, it was lovely, yeah. And I'm just, we came in and I just saw Lily on the front of the newspaper here as well. She's on the front of everything. She looks stunning, she? There she is. She's on the front of the mail. She's on the front of all kinds of papers. There she is, looking gorgeous. Is. Absolutely she's gorgeous. She's wonderful and she's she's so brilliant in the movie. I'm what a great proud. cast you've got. There's yeah. yourself, there's Lily, there's Derek Jacobi. I know, Marvelous. Derek's amazing in the movie as well. I know. But you know what? I didn't really know much. What I really loved about this film was, I didn't know much about Tolkien. Obviously, we all know Lord of the Rings. You know, mm. We know the books, we know the movies, we know all of that, but we don't know much about him. So it was, it was actually really good to find out his story and then to see, oh, so that's where he got these ideas. I get that. Now. Yeah, it's kind of bizarre when you think about it because I, I'm a fan, mm. almost. I, I, like, I grew up, I got given uh, The Hobbit to read on the set of About a Boy by the directors of really? that. Yeah, so I, and then so suddenly I'm sitting there and, and, and I played the card game after school and, of yeah. The Lord of the Rings and I loved <laughs> the movies and I'm, and I'm sitting there and I, this script came across uh, to me and I was like, well, hang on a minute, how do I not know... This man's story, and then yeah. I, and I read it, and it was remarkable. He lived an incredible life, Amazing. and and the relationships and and the inspiration of where those stories came from and his yeah. passions. Um, I just fell in love with the story, so I feel very lucky to have got the chance to play him. It's amazing because you get to know him, but you also get to know a really, it's a really beautiful love story, actually, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Uh, him and Edith Bratt, who Lily yeah, plays, yeah. Uh, they met, they were both orphans and, and met kind of in, in care together, and, and, they're, and they're very similar. They're, their backstories, they had to grow up at a young age, yeah, yeah. Um, but both very creative souls, and, and they're the inspiration behind um, Beren and Luthien, the tales that uh, Tolkien wrote as well. And, here we are just before, uh, that, this is another thing, this is before Tolkien um, goes off to, to war. He, he fought in uh, World War One, and we kind of depict uh, yes. the Battle of the Somme in this movie, but, but also mixed in with some kind of hallucinations because he had uh, trench fever. Yeah. Um, so you kind of see him imagining also things from his... Um, from his stories. Yeah, exactly. And that, that's that's where you sort of all kind of clicks. It all just joins together. Yeah. It's, it's a remarkable story, it really, isn't it? I love the fact you did because I think we all read The Hobbit. Lord of the Rings was a hard read. I remember, I, I do remember reading it, but I remember as a kid, everybody read The Hobbit. We all knew the story. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And that's, what, that's what's lovely about this. You get the story mm. behind the story because suddenly you realise you're like, oh, well, hang on, where did all these things come from? And a lot of it comes from his love of language. It's, the, you yes, know, these relationships cool. and friendships mm. that he had. And then also he had this passion for language his, that his mum distilled in him, um, yeah. whereby he, he, he created his own languages. But you couldn't get more different, could you, from talking to X Men, I guess? Uh, they're, they're Is there going to be more? I feel, like, I feel like all of those things kind of stemmed from Tolkien's yeah, work. I do. Oh, you're right. amount, yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. All the things that we're fans of now. Very lovely blue. Um, <laughs> look, at, look at how much I'm pouting in that photo. Oh no, it's lovely. I'm really Doing working it. Um, yeah, no, it was fun. It was fun doing this X Men movie because um, Simon Kimberg, the writer and director, uh, kind of gave a, a, a new area for me to go to and play with that right. with that role because um, before he's very much been Charles Xavier's kind of right hand man. That's and, right. And, yeah. and this time it's kind of it's different where he doesn't always agree with him and, and his approach to. Um, to what he's doing, so it's, oh. it's, it's, it's different, it's fun. I'm I like looking forward that. to people I seeing like it. That. I like that, I do, I think that's good, because we care about those characters and we want to know more about them. You're going to be 30 soon, I can't believe it. How did that happen? Oh, I was like, am I? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, I sorry. Am. I Are you am going to have a big, December. giant party? Probably not. I'm no. not, I'm not I'm probably, I get too anxious about having parties, to be honest do with you. Yeah, you know I'm what? that person that would sit there and be like, no one's coming, I, I haven't got any friends, so I don't I do, do parties because of the fear of that. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Any time I have a party, I go, well, nobody's going to come. I don't even know why we bought all this food and booze. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Nobody's going to come. Nobody's going to turn up. I think sometimes a nice, quiet time, just you and the family is just really nice. That's, yeah, I'll it's really good. That, and where's it? home? Is home in America or over here, or do you just bounce? I kind of bounce around a lot. Uh, a lot. Um, uh, the rest of this year, I'm doing another show called The Great um, with Tony, the writer of um, The Favourite. So, so I'll be back here for a little while. But off to New Mexico for another job Excellent. before then. And then in between that, we'll just get your wee sofa in here and you can just stay for and as long as you're meantime, blinking well. Yeah, like. I was like, this is home. What do you mean? <laughs> Where's home? Exactly. It's over there. What a joy to see you and congratulations.